Alright guys, welcome back to the channel where today we have a ton of announcements for WWE 2K24 as not only do you have details on this year's cover star, but we also have the announcement of a ton of new features including new match types and brand new modes. Before we get into that though, if you're new to the channel and you want to stay up to date with all the latest news on WWE 2K24, then please do hit that subscribe button and turn on your notifications so that you don't miss out on future updates. So let's start off with the WWE 2K24 cover reveal, as 2K today announced that Cody Rhodes will serve as the cover superstar for WWE 2K24 with Cody gracing the cover of this year's Standard Edition. Alongside the cover reveal, we also got the game's release date, with WWE 2K24 set to release on Friday, March 8th, 2024. As for the Deluxe Edition, we have two superstars on this year's cover, with Bianca Belair on the left and Rhea Ripley on the right. Both covers also feature somewhat of a WrestleMania theme, with the background to the artwork including shots of each star at WrestleMania. Alongside the Standard and Deluxe Edition, we also have a special 40 Years of WrestleMania Edition, with this one featuring some of the biggest names from WrestleMania past and present, including the likes of Stone Cold Steve Austin, The Rock, Undertaker and Roman Reigns. For players who pre-order the game, you'll also receive this year's pre-order bonus, the Nightmare Family Pack. This pack includes four playable superstars, including two versions of Cody Rhodes, one being the undashing masked Cody Rhodes and the other one his alter ego Stardust. Also included is Cody's father, Dusty Rhodes, with a special 1976 version of Dusty, while the final superstar is one of Dusty's greatest rivals, superstar Billy Graham, who makes his first ever appearance in a WWE video game. For My Faction fans, you'll also get bonus content in the form of My Faction cards, with an action figure styled Mattel bruised Cody Rhodes, and for the first time ever, a special manager card featuring Cody's dog, Fero. In addition, should you pre-order the game digitally, then you'll also receive a free standard edition of WWE 2K23. For players who purchase the Deluxe Edition, this version includes the Nightmare Family Pack, the WWE 2K24 Season Pass featuring all five post-launch DLC packs, a My Rise Mega Boost, Supercharger and Gold My Faction cards for Rhea Ripley and Bianca Belair. You'll also be able to play the game three days early on March 5th, 2024. Moving on to the 40 Years of WrestleMania Edition, this is the most expensive version of the game at $119.99, though in return for splashing out a little bit extra, you'll receive a cross-gen version of WWE 2K24, all of the bonus content from the Deluxe Edition, and a 40 Years of WrestleMania pack featuring alternate attires including Macho King Randy Savage, Rey Mysterio from WrestleMania 22, Triple H from WrestleMania 30, Charlotte Flair from WrestleMania 33 and Rhea Ripley from WrestleMania 36. Additionally, you'll also receive Gold My Faction cards for each, instant unlocking of all playable showcase characters and the WrestleMania 40 Arena which will be added to the game after launch. Like the Deluxe Edition, the WrestleMania Edition is also available 3 days early on March 5th, 2024. So that's all the details on the cover and the additions, but what about new features? Well, to quote the press release, WWE 2K24 features several franchise advancements, including 2K Showcase of the Immortals, celebrating 40 years of WrestleMania, four new match types such as Ambulance and Special Guest Referee, two new My Rise experiences, and much more. In addition, fans can also look forward to a massive roster of more than 200 WWE superstars and legends including Roman Reigns, Andre the Giant, Becky Lynch, Batista, Kurt Angle, Asuka, Bret Hart, Brock Lesnar, Macho Man Randy Savage, China and more. So there's a lot to unpack there, with the biggest news being the addition of four new match types, with the press release going on to state the following. Players asked and WWE 2K24 delivers with four new chaotic match types, special guest referee, ambulance match, casket match and gauntlet match. Showing off special guest referee, in screenshots released by 2K we got our first look at this match in action with a shot of Shawn Michaels refereeing a match between The Undertaker and Bret the Hitman Hart. Alongside this screenshot, we also got a preview of the casket match with a screenshot of The Undertaker and Shawn Michaels. Based on the screenshot, it looks like the version of the match that we see will be similar to the one that was featured in the 2K15 showcase with a casket placed next to the ring and players forced to roll their opponent into it. 
As for the Ambulance match, while it did make a brief appearance as an exclusive match type on the Nintendo DS, this will be the first time that we've seen the match on console. According to the press release, 2K24 will also see updates to existing matches as it goes on to state, in addition, the backstage brawl now features for player support and new interactive environmental elements including a working elevator, breakable control room glass and a vending machine with throwable sodas. The Royal Rumble match now offers support for 8 online players in a 30 superstar online match. So this in itself is big news, as 2K have listened to feedback regarding the backstage area and addressed that with the addition of new interactive elements as well as boosting the amount of players from 2 to 4 which should make for much more exciting matches. Moving on to this year's 2K Showcase, the rumours surrounding 40 years of WrestleMania were also proved right as this year's showcase will feature some of the biggest matches from all 40 years of WrestleMania including Hulk Hogan vs Andre the Giant from WrestleMania 3. Sharing more details on the showcase, the press release reads, 40 years in the making, the WWE 2K24 Showcase of the Immortals puts players in control Playing through the most iconic moments in WrestleMania history as 2K's distinctive slingshot tech seamlessly morphs gameplay to live action footage and back again for the most immersive WrestleMania video game experience to date. A host of unlockable content adds challenge and replay value to this historical experience. Moving on to gameplay updates, we also have some exciting updates here. As the press release states, WWE 2K24 features improvements to gameplay throughout, including super finishes, the Trading Blows minigame, top rope dives into a group of opponents outside the ring, double title matches, new paybacks and much more. New weapon types including trash cans, guitars and microphones, plus the ability to throw weapons allows players to bring the pain. Also, seven real WWE referees are now featured to add to the immersive experience. Moving on to my rise, similar to last year we're getting two stories to play through with Undisputed for the men and Unleashed for the women. The press release goes on to state, featuring Roman Reigns, Cody Rhodes, Mick Foley and others performing My Rise voiceover for the first time, alongside other superstars and legends, expanded rewards, original My Rise characters and unlockables carrying over into other game modes and new environments, My Rise is more impactful on the overall WWE 2K experience than ever before. Moving over to my faction, we have the addition of a new card market where players can search for and purchase specific cards, a new ranked quick play option, leaderboards and unique rewards including a new reward shop and more 4v4 match types. Over in my GM, the press release notes that the mode continues to expand with new GMs and brands to choose from, more new match types, more dramas, more championships, talent scouts, superstars trading between brands, superstar contract management and the new superstar journey which allows superstars to earn XP, train and level up to gain new benefits after participating in matches. Meanwhile, Universe fans will also have something to get excited about with the addition of expanded rivalry options including run-ins, money in the bank cash-ins, scenarios and brawls as well as new cutscenes, special guest referee support, double title matches and a loser leaves town stipulation. Other new features are also being added to the creation suite which includes the addition of a new creator referee mode as following the addition of authentic WWE referees, players can also update and create their own. Alongside that, we also have the addition of create a sign which gives players the ability to create custom signs that will then be held up during matches. As for anything else, we also got the announcement of some additional features with the press release also touting incredibly realistic graphics and improved animations with over 90% of facial expressions updated plus improvements to ramp cameras and dive cameras and the ability to move the camera during live gameplay provide the most visually impressive WWE 2K experience to date. Given these announcements, players will now finally be able to customise the camera, potentially switching it from a crowd view to the stage which is a feature long since requested while the updates to facial expressions should make for a big difference when it comes to cutscenes. So there's an absolute ton of details to get excited about as WWE 2K24 looks to expand in pretty much every direction with updates to gameplay, new match types and new create modes. So let me know what you make of all the announcements in the comments and stay tuned to the channel as I'll have more updates later today. 
Until then though, thank you so much for watching. Have yourself an awesome day, and I'll catch you later.